Hi, my name is Stephanie Thomas and I am applying to the Master's Program of Psychology and Professional Counseling at FIU. I'm currently an FIU student pursuing my bachelor's degree in sociology, which I will be done by the end of spring 2021. A little bit of background knowledge about me and why it is that I am so passionate about mental health and psychology in general stems from a lot of experience and life events. It all started when I was about six or seven years old. I went through an extremely traumatic event and there was a man who was a family friend of my parents and he became obsessed with my mother and ultimately wanted my mom all to himself. One day he came to our house, our apartment when we lived in New York and he planted, started some type of concoction that created a bomb in our home and there was an explosion and I pretty much almost died. Unfortunately, that's not it, and the story continues. After he gets sent to prison, he makes a phone call in prison to some guy, I guess his friend, and has that guy plant fake bombs in my dad's car. It was a whole set up plan, and they basically had someone call the police saying that my dad had bombs in his car which my father had no idea that, what is that even doing there? Basically, even in prison, he was still trying to set up my dad and like get revenge or like just ultimately wants to kill my dad and doesn't want my dad with my mom. So after that, it was time that my parents picked up and we moved and we started fresh here in Florida. Having gone through so much as a young child, I'm really proud of the person who I've become today as an adult and I could have let it break me. I could have let it destroy me and my spirit and I could have let it mentally affect me, but I didn't. And you know what? I really have to thank my mom for putting me first and putting me and my brother into therapy because you know what? If it wasn't for that, I don't know what would have happened. I don't know really how I would have coped, how I would have gone about life after that. I am an example that therapy works and PTSD is curable. PTSD is avoidable. All I wanna do in life is help others with mental health issues and help them overcome it because it is possible and I am prime example of it being possible, especially with trauma. Some more background information that makes me a great candidate for this master's program would be my work experience. I have worked with children for about seven years and that's just professionally. I've been volunteering at things and events that have to do with children even since I was in high school. I've been a substitute teacher for four years. I've been a VPK teacher. I've done aftercare, I've done tutoring, I have done babysitting, you name it. So I have that experience and I truly believe I have the ability to connect with younger kids and I have that interpersonal skills that I can conduct for my future, which would be ultimately a therapist for children. Some other skills that I would like to add is I have great communication skills, I have great interpersonal skills, I have great listening skills, I can empathize with others, especially since I have a history of mental health, I am definitely able to connect with a person and understand what they're going through and show empathy. Along with my work background, I also do have a pretty good educational background as well, because like I said, I am majoring in sociology, which does go hand in hand with psychology, and I do think that will definitely benefit me coming into this master's program. I can proudly say that I have been on the Dean's List for the last three semesters here at FIU, so I definitely feel confident that I will excel and succeed in this program. My educational goals is basically to obtain my master's degree in psychology, professional counseling. That's what I want, that's what I've been dreaming of. My career goals is ultimately to become a therapist, a professional counselor certified by the state of Florida. This program will give me all the tools and knowledge I need to become a successful counselor. I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you so much for your time.